We're just two days away from the big game. The Atlanta Falcons will take on the New England Patriots. And with the team so close to Birmingham and the running supermarkets, they're getting ready for a big rush of people preparing for the big game party. CBS 42 News reporter Brittany Bivens in Homewood live for us tonight, shopping and getting ready for the game herself. Hey, Brittany. Hey, Jim, we are here at one of the most popular aisles this Super Bowl weekend, the chip aisle. And while right now we are still probably seeing just regular weekend crowds, store managers tell me they could see up to 10 to 15% more shoppers than a normal weekend. And they say that every year this is kind of a kickoff of its own for the supermarket industry. They will, of course, sell plenty of alcohol, but they also plan to sell a lot of food items for big game parties. That, of course, includes all of the food you would expect chips, cheese, rotel, chili, salsa, and meat products. Managers tell me it doesn't always matter who's playing in this game. A lot of people will just use it to get together with their friends and family. And that is good news for supermarkets who could see a sluggish start to the year. The, the good thing about Super Bowl Sunday is it, it, it kind of gives us a starting point for our business to start picking up for the year. Up until then, we're usually kind of, you know, in a lull after the holidays. But for Super Bowl and Valentine's, that's when it starts picking up. And a lot of supermarkets, of course, will have those big game day displays and a few coupons and special deals to try to get you in the store. And if you are planning to do that, you may want to plan a little bit ahead of time because they tell me that things generally get the most busy Saturday evening or Sunday right before the game. Live in Homewood, Brittany Bivens, CBS 42 News.